What is up guys and welcome back right here we're in Venice Beach and we're going to be grabbing all of the gaps and in the description you'll have a link to all of the individual gaps as well as a playlist having all of the videos I've done so far for the Gap Master Trophy which I have since achieved. Right let's get into this first one is going to be right there <laughs> big double five set. I was looking at Skate Heaven and there's over 65 gaps and I was trying to get it up last night and I just like couldn't figure out some of the uh, some of the moves but uh, I did do it this morning so now it's just a matter of getting all the videos up there is the big vent gap right there cake transfer and tight landing is going to be next and there's also another one here I can't see it on my notepad here so tight landing transfer cake transfer and VB huge transfer right there thank you all right next up is going to be the uh, vent to roof I think it is yeah now there's a whole lot of them over here guys but I use a uh, the start from the beginning most of the time because uh, if people use the description for shortcuts then uh, they can see exactly where to go there's a couple of guides up now where the guy just starts in the middle of the of the of the whole stage i have no idea where to go so i thought i would uh, build on that there we go table pop but uh, that wasn't in that particular description we are going for the which one are we going for here huge roof to ramp no we're going to the fatty transfer right there now, if you carry on going up that side and over the other side, it'll be the thinny transfer, <laughs> I think it is. Onto the fence we go. Now we're going to go huge roof to roof ramp. And that's going to be the one right in front of us there. You can also jump over the left gap. You can manual along this vent over here and you'll get another one. I'm not just saying that because uh, you're in the area, but uh, like I said, the way I structured the guide, you're just able to use the shortcuts. So you want to go from here, <laughs> as you can see, it was my second attempt. <clears throat> right over there, that is huge roof to roof ramp. A oh, huge roof to roof. <laughs> I can't talk properly. Okay, we're going up next to the little vent gap and Muska's gap. Are we? No, we're going to the large set of stairs, which is going to be the Venice Beach ledge over here. All we have to do is go down like that. Ledge 9 set. Then you can turn around and go back up. And I thought I'd get the Venice Beach ledge. But you have to go the other way around. So let's go back down. There we go, the Venice ledge. And then behind us as well is going to be one of the transfers, just like the collectibles in the storyline. Hope you guys are enjoying this game as much as I am creating these videos. Absolutely love it. It's so good for making guides. Tons and tons and tons of fun. So we're going to go right over here to get Muska's Gap. Right there. And we're going to swing around. And we're going to launch over that gap. And we're going to get the little vent gap right there. Little vent gap. Okay, what have we next? Massive 20 sets. So we're going to jump down the left-hand side of this staircase, because uh, the staircase is only on the left. Makes sense. Okay, now we're heading up to the weird little roof gap, and then the mid-sized roof gap, and then the sick roof gap. Now, this was probably the most difficult one for me to get. Uh, mid-sized roof gap right there, the wee one before that. Now we're going to do the large one. Now, we'll show this again in slow motion to show you exactly where I launched from. So just to the right of the corner facing you, and you'll see he goes over a bit to the right hand side as you hit it. And then I did the boneless because it's kind of like pushing up thinking I would go further. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. But there it is. Next up, the two planter pops. So you want to jump over it lengthways and widthways. And you'll get both of these quick sticks. Like so. There it is. Roof to roof ramp. No, it's roof to ramp. So this is going to be... Which one is this? Yeah, probably going from this roof onto the one down below. We'll see here. Yeah, it's quite a brutal one, but not too difficult to spam R2 and you'll get into line pretty quickly. Okay, table pop, ledge to ledge and up, up, up and away. Or up, up and away. So the first one is going to be along here. Oh, oh wow, looks like I didn't edit that out. That's my bad. So we're going to go from here, we're going to use these two benches, well, ledges. And that's ledge to ledge, and then up, up, up. <clears throat> if you get enough height, you'll get and away. So if you don't get that, just try again. VB pit transfer, and uh, skinny transfer. This is what I was talking about earlier. We are back in the area of Muska's Gap. Yeah, it's like, I, oh, I did edit that. Yeah, VB pit transfer right there. And then we're going to go back the other way in a second get this one over here we have to go from this the skinny transfer right there as you can see it was a did something strange there kind of pushed me back 
I tried it again and eventually I got it there but I did get it the first time as long as it stays blue and doesn't go red if you wipe out you don't really get the move but if you've got the game mods on like I have to for the video then there's no issues of that and there's gonna be another one right there west side transfer what do we have round the horn next so what you want to do here uh, let's see what I do first Oh yeah, to do a wall. Oh, I thought I was going to do a wall plant off there. We're going to do these two ledges. There's bench tripping right there. Then we are going to go. I think it's over to the right. <clears throat> the vent to roof gap there is going to happen all the time. So this one over here is to land on the rail, as you can see. That's the seaside handrail. And then there's another one where you just land on the ground. I think it's the ground. Let's see here. Yeah, you just roll off with no no ollie, guys. Then you get the ten point landing. No ollie on that one. Okay, around the horn is going to be around this pool area, or the quarter pipe area. Done and dusted. Candy cane manual. This is the vent I was talking about earlier. You can manual across it, and you'll get this one. Awesome visuals on this. I like the water on the roof. It's pretty cool. I love my alien character. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever get rid of him. Until I start getting some nice clothing. There we go, candy cane. Oh, is that candy cane with a K, I think it was. I have to have a look at the spelling of that in the... Timestamps. Okay, now we're going to go for the. Yeah, this is going to be the. Uh, can you make it the table pop? So you have to land on the table at the start. If you land on the wood, it's not going to count. So you'll get table pop, he could, all the way, and touchdown. Okay, ramp to roof. And also the skater heaven, the last level. It's just got so many gaps that are so similarly named. It's crazy. Get confusing even just writing them down. I'm getting confused with them. Zag gap, zigzag gap, zap zig gag. <laughs> it's just crazy, crazy. On the fence, so we're going to go right at the beginning of the first fence. And then when you land, I thought, hmm, that's strange. Let's try that again. So we're going to go from the wall, that uh, just before the flat part of the wall. So just a little bit on the curve at the start. And then I got it coming off the fence of this one. Make sure not to get launched over the edge because if it goes red, it won't count. And here we're going to go for, what are we going for? Uphill canyon jump. Oh, this is fence to roof over here. And that was also on the fence before that. Uphill canyon jump. Let's have a look here. And then we do the high wire. It wasn't as difficult as people make out to be. I did try a good couple of times from the roof. And then I found a different method, which was a lot easier. So we'll check that out in a second. So that's going to be from that kicker ramp onto that roof, guys. You can't just jump from roof to roof. It says we complete, but we're not. We're going to go grab the high wire now. Now, like I was saying before, I tried to get it onto this roof, or from the roof every time, and I couldn't. So in the end, I came from here, and launched up and got it right there. And I'll show you in a second here, some slow-mo action. Just take note of where I launch from, and then everything else is history. So the dead center of that table, and it knocks you over to the right. Well, there we have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the guides. Please smash the like button if you are really enjoying it. And you can contact me about any difficult game parts or trophies that you are having. So I want to say thank you so much for watching, guys. I want to catch you on the next one.